What the f- Hello, ladies, gents, and disturbing puppet masters ready to kidnap another victim. I'm going to claim what's mine. Down we go, the elevator. I he did not confirm that I can just drop. But surely I can just drop, right? I can just drop into that arena. Yeah, yeah. And then not die? Whoop. Yes, I can. Hello. Oh, we meet again, but I know how to destroy you. You will not kidnap me again. I mean, you will uh, do whatever you want with my butthole. That is something that you you are free to do, but I am fresh, full of flasks. You're not going to get me. Not four times in a row. Wonder if it kills me again. Wonder, wonder if it will teleport me again or it will just freaking kill you. Oh boy. Hit. Oh, attack. Attack while it's open. You didn't get me, you bitch. Oh, you filthy creature. You're gonna charge. And I will dodge. No, what the. <laughs> yeah. The. It got stuck with the stuff at the top. We just need a, a nice straight path of attack. That actually hit me. Sure. You can't get me. Revenge is mine. Give me what's mine. It's all mine. Piece of garbage. Okay, now that I have rightfully avenged myself, I'm going to go back to that place. I'm going to find out what the hell uh, is going on in that, uh, that damn place. What, you want to summon me? You go to the trouble of trying to trap me and and give me all kinds of rashes from the chafing? Unacceptable. Eh? Just jump. Completely unacceptable. You know, I'm so glad that they did away with item durability because you know these filthy snails, lava snails, will just destroy the durability of your items if that thing was still a a uh, thing that happens in Elden Ring, you know, in the Dark Souls saga. I mean, the thing. Smithing Stone 4. I want Smithing, Smithing Stones 3. Smithing Stones 3, that's what I want. Uh, I don't see any loot. I don't see any loot, so we can just go forward. No, that's a kukri. Please. That's what I want. Alright, moving on. Give me another incredible challenge. Yeah. <laughs> All right, it's not a horrible fight arena. It's just a weird cavern. You know, right below the lava, of course, there's a nice little pond full of fresh, amazing, drinkable water. Oh, makes all sorts of sense. <laughs> it's okay, The you see? It's a artificially created lava moat. And oh. Well, this is some serious nonsense. I, I figured out why, by the way, I cannot summon this. Simply because there wasn't one of those summoning stones. You can't just summon the spirits wherever you go. You need one of those weird summoning stones in order to do it. Need that. Even the pickle. We're gonna eat a pickle. I don't know where it is, but we're going to face it with... Oh boy, <laughs> two at the same time, huh? And you don't have the rotors. You have some super giant mega axes. Attack! Ow. No. <laughs> Wonder if I shake, 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 shake. Maybe it will uh, toss me out earlier. I don't think that is a thing that happens in Elden Ring. Okay, so this is horrendous. Ow. Oh! Okay, you're doing the... There you go. I'm, I know that there's a Super Blade Maiden charging up a mega attack behind me. But... Holy crap, it just doesn't stop. But if we focus on the wheel virgin... It's behind me. 
to murder me. He wants it. <laughs> I don't know why he wasn't doing anything. But I'm, I'm glad, sure glad he wasn't. Okay, we're gonna do the, the big attack. <laughs> Love how the scythe goes around the corner so it actually hits inside the weak spot. Look, I don't know what the blade fellow is doing. Ah! Just keep panic rolling. That will solve all my problems. I have no idea. Come on, I thought for sure. Be done. I must say, uh, I don't know what's your problem, you blade weirdo. But uh, it does seem like you were horrendously malfunctioning. Is it snakes? Is it a person that's in there? What is going on with these creatures? Swing sickle. Abductor virgin. Okay, you can do it. Oh, I was about to just give you room to, to do your thing. That's a lot of damage. Please stop. Please stop now. Okay, don't, don't destroy me. Now oh, another one. Can I summon in here? No, you can't even summon in here. That's how much of a garbage ambush it is. I don't know what this is. You're just going to start swinging and rotating, huh? Attack! Yeah, well, at least I got an attack in. Well, this is very hu terribly humiliating. My butthole looks like an interstate tunnel. The trauma from this. Do you have any idea how much you're gonna have to spend on therapists? Just imagining the horrendous spectacle that happens whenever you go in there. Okay. But it, on the way back, it also swings. Please stop. It's so hard to get some damage on this thing. I guess just wait until that happens, dodge it, and then repeat. Woo! I had no right to dodge that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> the other one swings, pulls it back. Come on, come on, you weird ass snakes. I don't think it's wise, especially with my current testis. To uh, jump into the attack. Just wait for that to happen. You dodge back. You go back and get a nice bit of uh, nice bit of damage done. Oh, another swing back. Huh? Yeah. I feel like that right here. After this swing happens, you get an attack opportunity. Uh oh. We're almost there. Just don't get ultra murdered. Wah! Inquisitor's Girandole! <laughs> Show me the Girandole. I'm ready to wield a Girandole. Where are you? What is it, like a uh, spear, maybe? What kind of weapon is a uh, Girandole? Spear. I don't have the faith necessary to wield this, but I want to see how it looks. Pretty neat. It's just a spear, though. Spears are right behind rapiers in boring factor. Very cool weapon, though. Back to my scythe. The absolute best looking weapon in the entire game. That's where it came from, I assume. Because there's a side of grace going forward. So clearly, the other path must be where I came from. Well, that was a good time. A good, awesome slaughter of abductor virgins. Don't take it out of context. Can maybe spend a level. Mount Gelmer. Okay, I'm not going to explore this place. This is like literally a brand new place. It will probably connect 
with this path over here is just the next area to go to, right? I'm not going to do sequence break anymore because you see, Raya Lucaria is already kind of out leveled. I am blazing through it, just slaughtering everybody in my path. So I don't want that to continue to be the case. I wanted to do something with all these runes, though. Before we do this, I'm going to go back to Rani's Rice. Go back to Siluvis and buy everything he's got. It's not my fault. I'm a completionist. I just want to hand over this crawl, huh? Sure. Oh, he just gets... Or is this a quest that he had for me? I don't know, man. Sure, you can have it. Is that a scroll? I won't bother to ask where you pilfered. Yeah, it's probably just for more sorceries, right? To assume I'm one of the few who can decipher it. So I'm perfectly happy to take it Probably off. should have given this to Selin. That said, don't you dare get your hopes up. More often than not, new knowledge is merely an opportunity to reflect upon the mediocrity of one's intellect. I see you speak from experience. Let's see. Yeah, you just get new stuff. Um, well, that's 12,000, huh? I don't have enough runes to buy everything he's got. Seems like this is the evil sorcerer to give things to, and then there's Selen, who is the less evil sorcerer <laughs> to give things to. I'll get that one and a Glintstone comic, Comet shard. How about that? I guess we'll, we still have... Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, whatever you say, fellow. Just keep providing sorceries to me. One day I might use them. You never know. Um, so let's just... Con I feel like Seluvis is one that is universally hated. So now you get to see what it's like to actually work with Seluvis. Isn't that amazing? Let me just do a little bit of murder here. Just a little bit of casual murder. There you go. Did I just see one of the summoning... Yeah, this summoning pool is now functional. So now I should be able... Never mind. I, it also needs to have the zone enabled. The, the, there's a icon that I'm sure you remember. It looks kind of like the Baldekin Blessing, which reminds me. Please. Use the stamp Baldekin Blessing. There you go. Hasha! Death upon you. Oh, you. Where you come from? You little bookworm. Hiding behind your books. And we just keep rolling forward. This steam rolling train cannot be stopped. Oh. Appears to have gone caught in the walls. Well, it's a bit of a problem when they get... What is the jar? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> this is not in the script. The three sorcerers too tall to butthole. They, with their magics and their book thumpings, presented a... presented a... challenging foe. And then, the giant animated jar came out of nowhere to stuff butthole inside of its entrails. I don't know if that flows. Well, I really wanted to roll, but I got stun locked. Hsha! Good, good attack, good attack. Another one! You got wrecked! I can't see where your weak spot is at, so I'm just going to keep attacking you. I love how they explode in a horrendous shower of gore. Good times. And it really is gore if. The lore is that uh, they stuffed, they stuffed heroes inside of them to steal their power. Okay, you're no longer a threat. Holy crap, that was actually hard. And here I was bragging about being able to uh, eradicate everything in Raya Lucaria. Can I just come over here? No. It shall be opened in the future at some point. Yet another victim. To my side. Ow. Yeah, yeah, I knew there would be somebody. Didn't stop me from bloodthirstily 
separating the paint. A bit of a problem here with all the all the hits I'm taking. The upcoming boss battle. Watch timing. Such timing. Fantastic. You guys have a lot of things to say. Oh, thank you. Thank you. That is why you play online. So you don't have to figure things out. You use... Oh, look. It's messages in front of a wall. Comment. And you have a storm sword key. More to my collection. Nice little ladder over here. I wonder why my lamp just goes off. What happened to, for my lamp to go off? Oh, I uh, transported myself over here. That's why. I was in the other place. The weird volcano area the, that never roasted my anus. The way it was supposed to. Seems like uh, you just jump over. And then you can have it the land between the walls. Okay. No enemy ahead, but how about a secret? Never mind. It was a good attempt. Well, that looks like death. Let's see. Hello. Be wary of decoy. Yeah, I see the jar. I see the freaking jar. Hushah! You pieces of garbage waiting in ambush. Ready for me to grab the sweet, sweet, shiny item. I will not be taken in. You disgusting carrion feeders is what you are. Graven school talisman. Probably there's more jars. Hello. Can you idiots even reach me? Not inventory equipment. Graven school talisman. It's very easy to to see. Racist potency of sorceries. Interesting. Like I said before, magic is kind of a bummer in the Soul series. It's so clunky to have to equip the charm or whatever it is the casting item is, and then scroll through it and be able to see only one at a time. I feel like that's a deliberate choice in favor of balance to make it clumsy so that you can't just be nimble in your fights when you're a sorcerer you have to you know uh, muck about with the in with the <laughs> interface but i feel like that that's a terrible way to balance it if that's the case if i were able to just bind sorceries to one two three four boy would i be the greatest sorcery sorcery user of all time i will be so much more ready oh my wife's on the way home we're 18 minutes in that gives me uh, the 38 minute mark i am uh, entering a boss fight and i just casually came in here <laughs> did i already kill you You are the same creature, but you're wielding a sword. I don't think I don't think the other guy that was behind Caria Manor wielded a freaking Sith sword. That being said, holy crap. I do a ton of damage to your face. That also being said, you do a lot of damage to me. Absolutely disgusting amount of damage. Ow. On this Red Wolf Radagon. Over here, Red Wolf. Oh, mistakes. Oh, mistakes were made. Ah. <laughs> that was not a panic roll, not at all. Feels like overwhelming force. Oh, that's gonna shoot. Anus. Why would you do that uppercut thing, though? That was kind of dumb. I don't know why I just drank that. I guess it does give me the stamina. Ah! How about... Just attack, 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 attack! Ah! <laughs> That's too greedy. I was like, ah! I'll just keep right-clicking. It will be enough damage. 
pretty cool fight. It doesn't seem like it has a very good uh, health pool. Like a, a scythe plus five is nothing that incredible, you know? It's not like I am equipping. Holy crap, all the way back here? It's not like I am equipping. Ugh. The forlorn super curved sword plus eight or anything like that. It's just a heavy scythe plus five. Anyway, why am I killing these people again? Just completely bypass. Since I need to craft some more fire resin. Not interested? Not interested in any of your... Please stop. Okay, in we go. Set my thing on fire because you see it's a fire fox. So the resonance as the fires interact... Where are my runes, though? Please. <laughs> you guys see my runes? I don't see them. I can't just... There they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're very busy. Just swing about. I need to get my runes back, even though it, were... it was hardly any. <laughs> Barely any runes. All right. Good stuff. Good stuff. Ow. Chewing my face off, brother. Don't follow up on that. Just hit you in the butt. As long as I can just have a little bit of time to heal. We should get this. Because the health pool on this poor fox. Wolf thingy. Probably a fox because it's red. That sweet jump over the attack. Fantastic. Huh? Down! Bad dog! Ooh. You can't hold a candle to sift, brother. Oh man, that's uh, actually bad. <laughs> Please, don't die! <laughs> oh, I actually landed. Did not expect it to. One more heal. Just the running attack. I don't know what that was. Please! That one hit. There you go. <laughs> Just... Stop running around like a weirdo. Take the scythe to the cranium. Let me carry on with my freaking life. Okay, what I'm going to do... I am very fond of receiving my wife when she gets home. It's it's like a ritual thing. It's like I feel like if, uh, if my wife gets home and I just keep doing what I'm doing... It's like, what? The, what? She doesn't matter? It's, it's not right. Even though she will do exactly that. She will just keep doing what she's doing many times. Oh, this goes to somewhere. Really? No no side of grace, huh? There it is. I was like, they usually have a side of grace after you kill a boss. It was just washed with the background. That was weird. That was weird. Can I level up? Level up my faith. 11. 12 faith. Ooh. I'm going to put points into faith. Eventually, they'll be worth something, right? And uh, when I get to 30... What's your deal? Summoning pool is now functional. Amazing. But there's no icon, though, so I cannot summon a jack shit. All right, brand new area. After the red super wolf. Big staircase. So, the video will end abruptly when she gets home. That's... That's my warning. So, and that should be about the 38 minute mark. So we still have some good times going forth. Here's the guardian of the jars. Are you putting your dick in these jars? I will not lay it past you. You absolute freaking weirdo. Something funky was going on in this place. Very secluded corner of the world. Don't want to know what you were doing. Crackpot. A crackpot for a crackpot. Beautiful. You're pathetic. I don't know why I'm killing these jars. It's so foolish. <laughs> I can just run away. They'll never catch me. These baby jars are trash. Wait. What do you have to say? Back ahead. Alrighty. 
Well, there's a path going up there. There's a path going forward. Let's go forward. Actually, no. Let's go up because there's a bunch of magic users here. And they're bound to annoy the crap out of me with range attacks. There you go. R1 for victory. I call it R1 even though it's a right click with my mouse. Oh, okay. Well, oh, but I can just jump over there. Not yet. Weird disciples. What was that? <laughs> that then almost one shot me. What the hell? What kind of super attack was that, fella? Keeping it just for me. Give me some of your clothes. Take butthole takes some time to strip naked that Glintstone wet blade. That does something. Allows me to do something. I haven't checked my crafting dialogue in a long time. Let me get some more fire grease. It's not enough in my in my stash. What else can I craft these days? Soporific grease. Coats are women inflicting sleep. I do have the pots that I have not used at all. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. The next enemy, I'm going to try out my sleep pots. Oh look, it's an enemy and it's fat. We're going to see if we can put the abductor virgin to sleep. Sleep! Probably not, right? <laughs> this is a... Uh, this is a... Uh, what's it called? A uh, contraption. A mechanical contraption. Probably only organics. Can be put to sleep. Yeah, I'm just wasting my pots, aren't I? Very stupid, very stupid. But it's okay. I'll forgive myself. I think it's, yeah, that comes back. I love how I actually damaged that fellow. Ow. Oh, that was some other asshole shooting at me. Yeah, okay. You're just gonna get wrecked. <laughs> yeah! Man, he comes back around. For sure. I've lost all respect for you, Abductor Virgin. You used to be so damn intimidating. Now you're just an, an automaton that I can easily figure out. Dodge. Attack, attack, attack. You're dead. What a sad, pathetic encounter. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. Onto their knees to lick my dick. Please, this scythe needs to go through actual flesh. Else, it shan't be effective as a means of murder. Rah! Oh, he was already dead. All these crabs. There's going to be a giant crab jumping out of somewhere. With there's babies, there's going to be the mama somewhere around this damn place. Hey, look. Bunch of weirdos around uh, Golden Seed. Filthy aristocrats. Vive la Révolution. We hate damn upper-class mongrels. Bring you down to the populist level. There you go. Good day. Okay, that was mostly pointless. There is a path down there. I think... Yeah, that's the elevator I was about to say. Oh, what's this? Hello. What are you? <laughs> Just a uh, shiny crystal crab? What's going on here? Okay. Obviously, we had to try this nonsense on. Ah, yes. I am the Burger King. Let's carry on wearing this most distinguished crown. Clearly fitting to my station. Piece of loot. Here's the crab. Attack. What, you think I'm intimidated by some crab? I killed a billion of you. You're not 
something that concerns me. You're dead. Overwhelming force. That's the answer to every question. Surely there's some kind of uh, item over here. Yeah, just don't call me Shirley. There's a message. Maybe there's a item ahead. All right, there's nothing to go dropping down. The exploration has happened. I have exhausted every path in this lower area, except this area over here. What you got? Liar head. Never mind. No opening over here? Well, clearly there's two places to go. The path over there, jumping over the rail, there was some stairs. Or right across. Let's go right across. Because there's a shiny and I must have it. I must get the thing. Yep. Oh, what? What the hell, man? Well, sure glad my greed got me out of the path of that thing. Are they automatic? Yeah, look at that. There's like a teleporter that just brings down the massive golden cannonballs. Surely I can just roll! <laughs> Well, I could roll. I got hurt a little bit, but not a big deal. Not a big deal. Oh, there's a teleporter over there. Be wary of parrying. There's a fellow. Open? Cannot open. Teleporter, where shall this transport me? What the hell? I don't want to go elsewhere. I want to... Fine, fine. Just travel to wherever this is going to take me. I will regret it. But do it. Just freaking do it. Gonna take me across the freaking universe. Liurnia of the Lakes, of course. I am in Liurnia of the freaking Lakes. Where is this? What? <laughs> Why? Why? Why does this come here? Why? Church of Vows. Is this where I get absolution? Uh, turtle Pope? It's the Turtle Pope. Welcome to the Turtle Pope Shrine, where the Turtle Pope will absolve you, you of your sins. Punished, aren't you? I welcome you to the Church of Vows. I, I love a little ring. I love you, Miza Miyazaki. Sacred chamber. My apologies for the unseemly state of affairs. Do you Grim, dark, abduction place? virgins. How it came to be known as the in Church one hand, Turtle Pope. Immediately after. Well, that is a shame. But who can blame you? The shattering has caused us, all of us, to lose sight of something very... You don't clear. look like you have very good eyesight to begin with. At the church of Aren't Vows, turtles mostly blind? The great houses of the I just pulled that out of my ass. No, that's rhinos. Rhinos are mostly blind. Oh, you serve uh, my enemies. Holds in view the monuments of both houses. You do know uh, I am going to slaughter both of those names you just gave me. You talk a lot. What does this say? You don't need absolution. <laughs> that's that's uh, amazing to hear. Did not expect for that message to happen. Gold suing me. Oh, that's just for... Uh, for the weirdo, for Bach. Probably can give even better outfits to me. Oh, was there something you are free to show? I would serve as your guide, only my legs aren't what they used to Oh, be. no, no, don't, don't get up, Turl Pope. You are free You're mag- you. You're- Unless, perhaps, you are in search of- Magnificence. In which case, I will share- Would blind me. Study sorcery incantations. Show Celestial Dew and Radagon. What is the Celestial Dew? If you do that, I would like to share my knowledge with you concerning the miracle of the Church of Valor. Radagon, cleanse yourself of the Celestial Dew. Use Celestial Dew to cleanse yourself of sins. All right. I don't really want to talk, but I can probably study incantations. Sure, I will get the Blessings Boon. How about sorcery? You give me a couple other things. 10,000 runes for that. About the miracle. 
Kneel in the basin at the back and cleanse yourself with celestial dew. Absolution will be yours. Any bond, no matter how strained or even severed, will be put to rights. And I don't need absolution, you say. You do understand that I just roofied Nefeli Lou. And she's probably right now being made into a weird-ass sexual puppet. But no, I don't need absolution for my sins. My faith does not waive the miracle rooted in these ground. And this time... Blah, 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 blah. Oh, there's the wife. We'll finish the conversation later, turtle man. 